Good morning, everyone. Happy Wednesday. <clears throat> uh, today's infusion clinic day, so I'm gonna hit the sheets, get some drinks, then I'm gonna get my eyebrows done, and then I'm gonna head over toward the VA and probably be in West Virginia for most of the evening because I think there's a Starbucks near the VA, and that's probably where I'll stop and do homework for the night. That and today's gonna be just a terrible travel day anyway because it's the day before Turkey Day and all the roads will probably be <laughs> traffic. And I hate traffic, so. Hold off for a couple of hours, which is what I'd have to do anyway for homework, so really, it's a win-win. So, I'm gonna get down that hallway, go to Sheets, get some drinks, and then head on over to Martinsburg. I'm parked outside of the Martinsburg, West Virginia VA Medical Center. The uh, C-17s are doing flybys. Uh, it's been 12 times in the last 15 minutes I've seen them circle the VA. It was really cool because they were doing a crosswind uh, landing on approach right over there. And as they were turning, the, the bird was also hovering in that direction. Kind of what you would, like a G-turn basically, which was awesome. Unfortunately, the closest Starbucks to this lovely building is 17 miles north in Hagerstown, Maryland. So I'm editing and posting the vlog here in the truck with the unlimited Wi-Fi connection that I have courtesy of OnStar. Uh, it's cheaper for the unlimited in my truck than it is for the five gigs on my iPad. And it's the same company that provides the service. Such is life. The vlog is 73% uploaded and I have to get inside here in the next 30 minutes. Uh, they asked me to come in early because the infusion clinic nurse has to go to an important meeting this evening. And it is, you know, the day before Thanksgiving, so thankfully I'm here early. And could do that because I was planning on being at Starbucks till 3 o'clock. But no Starbucks is in the area. 17 miles is the closest. It's probably where I'll end up after I'm done here in the effusion clinic. And I'm just now leaving the Martinsburg VA Medical Center. Of all the medical centers that I've been to, this is probably the better ones. Uh, better of the ones that I've been to. Probably the best. Wilmington's nice because it's small, but Martinsburg's nice because it's just, it's so far away from everything else that it just, it's pretty. And it's a very pretty campus. Um, so yeah. Currently I am probably gonna go to the Starbucks in Hagerstown, Maryland, only because uh, A, it's 17 miles away, B, it's three o'clock on a Friday, or Friday. I'm already thinking it's the weekend. It's three o'clock on a day before a holiday, so traffic's gonna be um, a bore. So I figured, hit, uh, hit the Starbucks up there for a little bit, get a paper done, get some more chapters read, and then go to Crumpy's Donuts and get myself some Crumpy's and uh, get crumpies for tomorrow, we can bring it to the hotel for dessert. I'm actually so excited about that. Damn crumpies donuts. But for now, I'm gonna keep my eyes on the road and I'll chat with you guys in a few. So I'm just finishing up at the Starbucks behind me in Hagerstown, Maryland. Uh, I've been over there before to the mall. It's where Mission Barbecue is. It's where I went the last time when I came here when the internet sucked. Internet still sucks here. But uh, tethering through my phone, it worked just fine, so. <laughs> Such is life. I've read another couple chapters in the text. I've written some posts for the class. All I have left is the paper on the chapters I just read and a final paper, which I need the DSM-5 for, which is currently sitting on my uh, end table near my couch. So can't do anything with that paper unless I have the DSM-5. But I have until Sunday morning at 2.59.59 a.m. to finish both papers. So, posts are out of the way. All I have to focus on now is the actual paper itself. And 
it's easy. Um, the final paper is on a mental disorder and it wants me to go into the specifics and the neurophysiological aspects of it and the regular essay paper is just an essay response on the two chapters that I've read so it should be fairly simple and straightforward but since I am in Hagerstown, Maryland I'm going to my favorite donut shop now called Crumpy's to go pick up some donuts. Well, that plan failed miserably. Crumpy's is closed, because technically they'd be open to Thanksgiving and they're closed Thanksgiving. Damn it. Oh well, such is life. But hey, now I've missed most of the traffic so I can go home and uh, get some food to eat for dinner, because that's a must. Well, it certainly was disheartening to learn that my favorite donut shop was closed, but I have pizza and ice cream to curb that craving. So I'm gonna get some food in me. It's uh, 8.30 at night. It took about an hour to get home. Uh, traffic's actually pretty light right now, knock on wood, but I'm already home so it doesn't matter. Uh, but a productive day nonetheless. Even if I, even if the donut shop was open, I still needed to sit at that Starbucks for the several hours I did to finish reading some chapters and uh, writing some uh, posts and getting the paper formulated and started. So. That was a necessity regardless, but <clears throat> it is what it is. So I am starving and this will be the first substantial thing I've eaten all day. So I'm actually looking forward to the pizza and a little bit of relaxations before bed. So onward to food. Day old pizza is always tasty, but <clears throat> one of the cheeses that are on it is not uh, sitting very well in my stomach. So I've had to take some Zofran again. So the rest of the slices I have thrown out because that's two days in a row where the cheese has done something that I'm not happy about. <clears throat> it's about 10 o'clock at night. Uh, dinner tomorrow is at two o'clock at National Harbor. So I'm gonna try and get some sleep tonight. That way I'm well rested for tomorrow, do dinner and then do homework afterward or hang out or whatever the plan is after dinner. But it does take about 40 minutes to get there from my house, and that's no traffic. So I'm going to blanket it by at least an hour, uh, just in case, and probably check into the hotel early if I can. Um, since dinner's at two, as a platinum member, hopefully I can check in at one, hopefully. But we shall see. But without further ado, I am heading to bed. I'm gonna end the vlog here tonight by saying, as always, have a great night. And I will see you guys tomorrow.